A Spokane stepmother who confessed torturing a four-year-old girl to death will spend the next 62 years in prison. Adriana Lytle pleaded guilty to homicide by abuse in the death of her stepdaughter, Summer Phelps. And a judge sentenced her today. KXLY 4's Eric Loney was in the courtroom where we heard from Adriana for the very first time. Eric? Yeah, and Adriana Lytle said she loved little Summer Phelps but was overwhelmed by her. She said the little girl was defiant and Adriana testified today that she thought a little pain would help the girl behave. Prosecutors called Adriana Lytle today a violent, vicious bully who, along with her husband, tortured the little girl to death. I wish I could change things, but I can't. Adriana Lytle testified her husband John was actually the driving force behind the torture of his daughter Summer. He'd spank her and he'd pull her hair and just he was just doing he he was just mean to her. Although Adriana admitted shocking the four-year-old with a dog collar, making her wash urine-stained clothes in the bathroom for hours, and dunking her underwater to punish her. Well, how long would you put her head underwater? Just dunk real fast and back up. Why would she be dumped? Because that's what my husband wanted me to do. I figured that if uh, there was a little bit of pain, then she would stop peeing on the floor when I tried to put her in the corner. She was a good girl. Did you love Summer? Yes. Why didn't you ask for help? Was there anybody you could have asked for help? My husband told me no. Lytle's attorneys called two psychologists to the stand today to testify how Adriana was physically and sexually abused as a child. My assumption was uh, that she had learned uh, through modeling uh, from her own parents how you handle children who are disobeying or not playing by the rules, and that included physical punishment. But Judge Michael Price sentenced Adriana to more than 60 years in prison for systematically torturing her stepdaughter. Coming to view Summer Phelps almost as if she was a parasite or a disease in her home that had to be removed. Adriana uh, Lytle will not be eligible for parole until she's in her 90s. Reporting live in the newsroom, Eric Loney, KXY4 HD News.